7 new this morning. We are getting you ready for the holidays, specifically staying safe during the holidays. And that is why we are pleased to be joined by MPD's Inspector Michelle Karen. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for being here. And Officer Amanata Jallo. Good morning. Good morning. So you're, you're seeing an uptick in robberies, car thefts. What do we need to do to stay safe? So as the mayor said, DC is open. MPD is very excited about inviting all the residents and the citizens in the DMV to come and enjoy all the festivities and the holidays. Mm -hmm. But MPD's layers are focused on our violent crime year round. But in December, we want everybody to kind of help us keep an eye on mm -hmm. the criminals who are gonna take the opportunities that kind of present themselves over the holidays uh, and take advantage of people. And we don't want that to happen. So if you're out and about and you do witness something or you see something a little sketchy, um, what should people do? Call 911. We're here 24 seven, so we're not taking any time off. Mm -hmm. If you see something, say something. I know it sounds, you know, contrite people hear that all the time, but it's true. Get the best look out that you can. If you have clothing description, vehicle description, car description, um, tags, mm -hmm. those are all very helpful for us to kind of keep an eye on who might be doing something a little nefarious. And do you have any tips for, for those watching? You know, you buy something and you're walking down the street at valuables, what you're wearing. Um, what are some things that people can really do to kind of keep them staying above, you know, being a victim? Um, well, I, absolutely. We suggest like putting your valuables in the trunk if you're if you're driving, so right? It's not seen. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. So it's not seen. I understand you want to hide the gifts from the kids and things like that, but we also want to hide the gifts and things like that from the criminals. So definitely put it in your trunk to keep it secure. If you are walking about, I suggest you walk in the daylight hours or um, brightly lit areas. Don't walk alone if you don't have to, you know, go shopping with a friend. Um, that's just some of the tips that we have. Do you all see an uptick around the holidays as far as crimes of opportunities for folks out here trying to take advantage of maybe unsuspecting people who are in a great mood, maybe not as, you know, vigilant as we should be? That, that's exactly it. I mean, it's a crime of opportunity. And we just right. don't want our citizens and the visitors to become victims. But criminals get up every day to do what they're going to do, and that's mm -hmm. try to take advantage of people. Um, so we're just trying to make sure that people are a little bit more aware, a little bit more cognizant of their you know, surroundings, maybe not paying attention to the phone while you're walking or having earbuds in and not hearing what's going on around you. If you're parking your vehicle, park the vehicle, get out of the vehicle, don't sit there and look at your phone because then mm -hmm. people are gonna walk so up guilty. and you're not paying yeah, attention. So it's very easy to, to kind of take advantage of people and we don't want that. Any last final messages for, for anyone out there? So if anybody has any information, and it's not just regular citizens, mm -hmm. but if you know someone who might be thinking about doing something like this, you have a couple of ways of contacting us. Our tip line is 50411, It's totally anonymous, and you can also anonymously call us at 202-727-9099 with any information you have. All right, Inspector Michelle Karen mm -hmm. and Officer Jallo, thank you so much. Thank we you. hope you are not that busy this holiday. Yes. <laughs> thank you, happy <laughs> thank holidays you to you all. Same, Same to you. Same to you. <laughs>